morning guys from my office hmm? yeah the start of my office looks different yes it looks different because I was first walked the beach to think about what I wanted to speak about because there was not that much news and now on the way back I will do my video I hope you will like it I need to check if the camera is on Bam. the camera is on okay guys today there is of course all the happiness about Bitcoin because we saw this huge run up from Bitcoin from 7,700 to 9,500 which feels amazing I know it feels amazing yes I am in the market for the true fundamentals of Bitcoin and for the mass adoption and you know for all this the decentralizations uh, Bitcoin will bring to the monetary system but still it's a lot of fun to see Bitcoin doing what it's doing just BAM going up like that just reaching for the stars and ultimately go to the moon <laughs> no man it's just so so cool to see whole market um, turning happy again you can see all the tweets increasing you can see all the people's posts are turning positive again you know people are just leaving all the negativity behind about this flu that has disrupted our life and democracy and uh, civil rights and now people start to focus again on the happy things in life and I think the bull run the next bull run we will see is part of that as well a huge but really a huge warning guys because every time when Bitcoin increases with a thousand dollars or more the past has shown us that there will be a pullback we already saw that we were trying to reach 9500 and we already had a small pullback to now um, 8700 ish but that is not what I'm saying if you look at the data of all the last runs that were bigger than $1,000 we can see that every time the first month Bitcoin uh, decreases in value like with 20% and like in the third month ultimately we will be like 30% lower so let's take an easy number let's let's say we go to 10k after the first month we will see about 2k drop that will be around then we will be around eight and the third month we could be around seven this is not my opinion but this is what history shows us check the graph i i am adding here in the video because you can see what has happened the last times we met a run up bigger than thousand uh, bigger than thousand usd the cool thing yesterday is that the Bitcoin dominance spiked up to the levels of 2017 just before the bull run. So this indicates to me again, this is a positive indicator for a next bull run. Because if we're nearing these BTC dominance levels again that were just there uh, uh, before the bull run in 2017, this could be an indicator that the bull run is near, that the bull run is around the corner. Same thing goes for you know the seven weekly candles I talked about yesterday in my video and um, the video I posted in the morning and I told you guys we are now in the seventh weekly green candle in a row this has happened a few times in history and every time it happened we saw a pullback for between 10 till 30 percent but after this pullback we have seen this massive runs of Bitcoin check the chart I'm putting it here in the video check it you see the green squares around the seven candles even eight candles I think because I think the eighth candle will, will make us go down into this pullback and you can see every time we had these eight green candles in a row we see a massive run a few weeks till months after again an indicator we are just in uh, before a huge bull run same charts all of the charts of the halving you can see that always the year after the halving we have seen a bull run so there are three huge indicators to me that we will see a huge bull run in the next couple um, of months but in all the previous uh, bull runs and halvings there was no possibility of shorting Bitcoin 
this is a maybe a big game changer that could be a big game changer because now the market has changed because now people are able to short Bitcoin and we don't know yet what this is going to mean for the halving or for the bull run because now you can short Bitcoin who says we are going to see this insane run up to a new all-time high this is the only warning I don't believe that this is going to happen I believe even those people that are shorting Bitcoin now are very and will be very happy to long Bitcoin just before the bull run so they have massive returns of investment because of longing Bitcoin and then they will short Bitcoin after this new all-time high that is what I think so um, I don't think it will have a huge influence but some people think that this leverage trading is a huge game changer and this could change the outcome of the next year after the halving and the bull run. Like I said that Bitcoin dominance uh, spiked to the levels of 2017 we, but we can also see if you look at the chart of the Bitcoin dominance and the downtrend that the alts have broken downtrend line probably because of the huge push um, of Ethereum of the huge growth of Ethereum and a coin that I don't want to name by name because I just don't like the centralized <laughs> the centralized coin um, but okay these two probably made uh, this altcoins break the downtrend line of uh, Bitcoin dominance but we went they went up and now they are retesting the line so it's very important what the next weekly candles are going to do how they are going to close and if uh, we will see an alt season or not I had a crazy cool chat with John McAfee and hard forking and um, John is just a really cool guy to have a chat with uh, he had a really cool life he has tons of stories to tell you in this chat man he even showed me his huge gun he told a story about the movie that's going to be made about him and, and this very funny story about how he scared a guy with, uh, with this beautiful game of Russian roulette. Um, it was just a cool chat about drugs, COVID, about freedom, about uh, government and all that stuff. Yes, you're used from hearing from John. So um, have a look. The link is uh, down below the video and it was a really cool thing. Thank you, John, for all your uh, uh, funny anecdotes about um, your life. <laughs> I truly enjoyed this chat with you. I'm looking forward to sit together with you somewhere on a beach or a boat and have a drink together and just talk some more crazy shit that has happened in both of our lives. <laughs> a good friend of mine, Saman, um, he skateboarded from the south to the north of the Netherlands in a five day trip skateboarded like skateboarding yeah you heard me uh, correct during this trip he did visit my place for one night with his team and his crew it should have been like this relaxing evening where he could stretch his legs have a massage and some healthy food but uh, you know I had another plan and it turned out a little bit different and it was an epic night as you will see in the documentary he made about this trip and about how with a change of mindset you can reach things and do things in life that you always wanted to do but didn't do yet and I really recommend watching this uh, documentary um, he's a good cool guy he even donated some revenue of the sponsors and everything to uh, an NGO I support as well in India which was really cool so Taman thank you for even visiting my place creating this beautiful artwork of a documentary and I wish you all the luck and success uh, the next couple of years with with all the plans you have in your mind in your beautiful mind I should say this was everything for today guys there was not a lot of news I'm still floating on this pink cloud of happiness because Bitcoin went up and we will see what it's going to do tomorrow is already Saturday so I'm going to wish you an amazing weekend make the best of this weekend and uh, just enjoy it to the fullest I think tomorrow I will not make a beach day video but I will probably share a beautiful video about our trip in Italy last year when there was no lockdown 
and we visited the uh, Tower of Pisa, we visited uh, the Vatican, we visited uh, the Colosseum in Rome, and we did all these things for the kids to educate them about the history of Italy. And I think I will share this, doc this video tomorrow instead of a beach walk. But who knows, if something very crazy will happen in the market, I will get up early again and I will make a video about the changes in the market. Please let me know uh, what you think about this video. Give it a thumbs up if you like it. Subscribe to the channel because we need uh, more subscribers. Uh, share it with your communities, please. Hit the bell button so you will be notified on the new videos um, I make daily. Be aware because Bitcoin can really retrace. Don't start to stress. Just accept that when something goes up this steep, it will come down for a period and then it probably will go up again. So please don't start stressing, don't start behaving like a ladyboy like my dear friend Vincent always used to say in his videos. It's not good for the market, it's not good for your mindset, for your, for your own peace because you can't start to stress yourself if you stress with every increase and decrease of Bitcoin's value because even if Bitcoin goes up to a million and comes to one dollar, the true fundamentals stay the same and the people all over the world are still changing the monetary system in this beautiful, peaceful revolution called Bitcoin. Thanks for watching today, guys. I wish you an amazing weekend. Enjoy it to the fullest and see you tomorrow again. Bye. When I bear down.